Shadow Puppeteer tricked me. It lulled me into a false sense of security. One moment I'm playing as this boy in his shadow, both being controlled independently like the brothers and brothers. Well, except the shadow could only walk on shadowy things. But the boy, he, he could walk on everything. Except the shadows, he, he couldn't walk on those. My brain could handle that, lazily solving these puzzles in my own time. It was nice, serene, despite the spooky atmosphere. But that all changed with the shadow cat. What is the shadow cat? The shadow cat is a cat which is also a shadow. Walk into the shadow cat and the shadow cat will kill you. Dead. The only course of action was to run from the shadow cat. It was obvious I had to use this minecart. What was I doing wrong? The shadow just wouldn't stay on. Clearly, it was something wrong with the game. It couldn't be my fault. Oh, except it was. I'd been an idiot. I should have looked at the controls in the first place. Now knowing the controls, I knew I could outrun that cat. Oh. I made the jump and kept on going, but with a finite amount of time, I was panicking. The gears and cogs in my head just stopped turning. I'd forget what was controlling who. I had to keep on going, otherwise the cat would get me. I managed to fumble my way to opening up the bridge. I ran as fast as I could. In my haste, I'd forgotten the minecart. Surely I wouldn't need that now. It was a deadly mistake. Now with the minecart in tow, I soldiered on against the shadow cat. But oh no, there was more fast-paced puzzles. My mind couldn't take controlling two things at once while an evil shadow cat loomed so close. It felt like the two hemispheres of my brain were flung out the window in opposite directions. I was a broken man. I managed to pull it together. No game was going to get the better of me. I could still outwit that shadow cat. I'd done it. Finally, after so many tries, the shadow cat was dead. I was elated, but it was short-lived. Shadow Cat had not really died. It had all been a big lie.